Hello, this is uh, Mr. Steve Almost here, wishing you a Merry Christmas. And we are going to be starting a new year. Now, I'm wearing my Christmas cat and hat tie. Now, the reason for that is, you know, basic cat and hat is basically make confusion. Makes things a little bit more confusing to try to figure out. Well, that's what we have this last year. A little bit more confusing to try to figure it out. You know, this last year was spent trying to figure out this internet market and definitely is something that you're going to have to look at. But basically, let's talk about you. You have to be ready to do something yourself. You can't sit around and wait. This market won't allow you to sit around and wait. I don't care whether you're in real estate like I am and you have to go out there and make a living by trying to sell property. And there's a lot of different ways of doing that from no money down situations. I may be talking about that on my websites or my Facebook later to the situation of rehabbing and flipping properties or buying a property just for yourself. With today's market, with the interest rates the way they are, how can you avoid not wanting to buy a property for yourself? Now, if you're renting, there's no excuse. I mean, you're probably paying more rent than you probably would be if you bought a piece of property for yourself today. And the interest rates are moving. If you looked at this last week, you saw that interest rates basically moved about half a point. Now, it doesn't mean a heck of a lot, but you start adding that up and every few dollars adds up every month. So, what are you waiting for? You've got to take action. You're the one that's going to be making the moves, not me. I'm here to help you. I'm here to give you as much information as possible. But you've got to let me know what kind of information you want. Nobody's informed me of that. And next year, I will definitely be a more up-to-date and try to put something on the videos every week for you. So that you're up to date. Maybe I'll concentrate on no money down situation. Maybe you need to know some information on how interest rates react and why they react the way they do. Maybe you need to know if you're in the business like I am, is how do you market to other people? How do you get the individual buyer to make a decision? How do you convince the seller in this market that if he wants to do something, he should not be greedy and try to make a few extra bucks? Because I have to admit, a few extra bucks is going to kill you. And I'll tell you, on the way down, you keep saying, well, you know what, if I would have made $350 last month and sold it, I would have done it. But now you've got to be on market for $320, and then two months from now, you're going to say, if I could get $320, I would have been very happy with it. And then you'll go down to $315, and you'll say, well, if I could get $310, I'd be happy with it. Well, that's the way the market goes. The greedier you are, the more you're going to lose. So learn. Now, this is not an easy market. This is a market you've got to do something. It is hard work. And I don't necessarily always mean in a physical sense. It's hard work just to be able to be knowledgeable of what you're doing. You have to be knowledgeable of who you're going to talk to, when you're going to talk to them, the timing of the market. The timing of any market is very, very important. You do timing wrong, you're going to lose. You do timing right, and you'll be in a fantastic individual and say, man, I know it all. And the trouble is, is every time you know it all, you're going to jump into something a little bit quicker with not being fully knowledgeable of it, and you're going to lose. Believe me, it's a step-by-step step by step decision you're going to be making, and you've got to know each one individually. Now, you don't have to personally know it. You have to be able to know the people around there to make decisions with you to help you as you go along. You cannot know everything. Now, remember, you can hire people out there not necessarily going to get what you expect. Believe me, you're not going to be able to get what you expect in a lot of cases. Hire good people. Check them out. Find the background. Hey, that's the way it is. Right now it's Christmas. It's time to be with families. It's time to be with friends. But you've got to be thinking in the back of your mind, it's time to get ready for next year. Anyway, this is Steve Almost, Mr. Steve Almost, talking to you right here and now. You have a good Christmas, and I hope to see you in a few weeks with money in your pocket. But in between time, listen to me like my fan page here, tell me what you really want to hear about and I will follow up with you. Have a good Christmas. Merry Christmas to all. Bye.